I've been highlighting some Android 15 features over the last few months, and one of the new additions that stands out is called Private Space. And today, I want to show you how to sideload and install Android APK files into the Private Space without downloading them from the Google Play Store. Now, I will assume that you have already set up the Private Space feature within your device, but if you're not familiar with what Private Space is or how it works, then I'll be sure to, to link to my introductory guide in the video description below. You'll also find that link in the pinned comment here as well, so that it's easy for everyone to find. But once you have it set up, let's go ahead and unlock it. And we'll be sideloading an APK here today with the help of Chrome. But you could use any browser that you have set up within your private space area. You're just going to want to make sure that you're launching the web browser from within the private space and not from your usual app drawer. With the web browser open, we're then going to download the APK file directly within Chrome. It won't matter if it's downloaded from a website like APK Mirror or if you're downloading from a place like GitHub. We just need to make sure that we open the page from within the web browser that is currently installed in your private space. We're then going to open up that APK file that was just downloaded, just like you normally would. You will then need to grant the app permission to install APK files if you haven't done so already but that's normal and you'll see the prompt appear if it's needed. Once it has been opened, go ahead and tap on install and let the application be installed to your private space. Now, when we minimize the browser and go into our private space, you can see that new application has been sideloaded just like normal. The process of moving data to and from Android's private space feature hasn't really been fully fleshed out. And that's why we need to use a browser to download the APK file and then install it from there. Android 15 does have a way that we can use ADB to sideload that file. And I could do a video about that if there is enough demand for it. So if that's something that you would like to see here on the channel, then leave a comment down below to let me know. But please remember to like this video while also subscribing to the channel for more Android 15 tips like this.